Hello, Guy here, back again with another BFBC bite, and I'm on commonilkvintage.co.uk shopping for some vintage clothes today. Um, it's a really quite a slick store, this, and it shows the power of Shopify for me. Um, these guys probably, I could be wrong, but they'll have had the start from finding vintage pieces and selling them on sites like eBay, Etsy, things like that, and they've made the transition over to making a store for themselves. I think there's two things you've got to be careful of when you're running a store like this. Um, and I can show you best if I find my way to a product page. The first thing is because it's vintage clothing and the way you acquire vintage clothing is very select and very slow. Often you will only have one item of that particular clothing in stock. So you can actually play on scarcity and urgency there and tap into a bit of human psychology. If there was a bit more of a banner or they made more of this part where it said there's only one of this item in stock when it's gone it's gone that again gives your customers another reason to buy and you have to act a little bit quicker if you actually want it so i think that's something the store can do and the other thing is about sizing so they've got the all the shoe sizes on here but if it's a coat or a jacket or something like that it's just never never very clear really and there's no brilliant way to do it and what this store have done is set up the size help page, which is a good way to do it. Perhaps a little video explainer would be great um, for different kinds of pieces. But yeah, I think that's a really good store. You should check it out if you're in this sort of game. All right, thank you.